What does for reference mean? When someone tells you for reference, they are typically providing you with a piece of information or data that will help to clarify, exemplify, or elucidate a point or topic under discussion. Let's say you're telling a story about a hike you went on in the stunning Columbia River Gorge right outside of Portland, Oregon. You might say, for reference, Multnomah Falls is 611 feet tall. That's your bit of information to help whoever's listening gauge the grandiosity of the landscape you're tackling. Or in a different scene, picture yourself in an intense board game night debate about the tallest buildings in the world. For reference, the Burj Khalifa is 828 meters tall, someone chimes in. That little nugget of information is supposed to serve as a benchmark, providing context for whatever comparison or argument you're engaged in at the moment. For reference can also be a prelude to citing a source. Let's say I'm writing about the growth of microbreweries in Portland, and boy, there's a lot to say on that topic. I might state, for reference, according to the Oregon Craft Beer Association, there are now over 200 breweries in the state. That's me backing up my ramblings with a reputable source for those thirsty for knowledge. So whether it's to provide context, comparison, or solid backup for a claim, for reference is like that trusty pocket knife you take on hikes. Not always needed, but invaluable when you want to cut through the ambiguity of a conversation.